Hello, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial video, I will show you how to model this part in FreeCAD 1.0. I fix parametric part template and I am on part design workbench. Click on create sketch and fix XY plane. Click on circle and draw a circle at the origin. Hundred mil for the diameter and for center. Draw another circle with one fifty ML diameter. Let's draw two circles on X axis around here with fifty mil and eighty mil diameters. and repeat the same on this side. Instead of adding dimension, you could also use equal constraints alternately. Press Ctrl key and click on this point, then this point, then this point. Click on Symmetric Constraint to make the sketch symmetric along Y axis. I am going to add dimension between these two circles to make it fully constrained. Now I am going to add lines to connect the circles. Click on line and click on this circle. Then this circle. Do the same for other circles. Click on this tangent constraint and pick the line and the circle. Do the same for others. Click on trim command. Pick these lines to remove them. Now the sketch is under constraint. As you can see, the constraint is lost at this point after trimming. Let's add the tangent constraint to fix the error. Now is fully constrained and close the current task. Click on pad, turn on symmetric to plane option, then 30 mil for the thickness and press enter. Now Pick the top face and click Create Sketch. Draw a circle at the origin and type 130 mil for the diameter. Close the window and click on the pocket tool. Enter 20 and click OK. I am going to switch wireframe mode so I can see all the lines of this solid model. Click on create sketch. Pick XY plane. Click on this command. Click on these circles so I can use it as external reference to create the new sketch. Draw a circle same as the existing diameter and draw another circle with 70 mil diameter. Do the same on this side.
click on close to finish the sketch. Switch this back to shading mode. Click on path. Turn on symmetric to plane option. Type 40 and click OK to finish. So far, the model is looking good. Let me add a small radius to some corners. Select this face and click on fillet command. Click on select to add more faces. Pick more faces to add radius. Click OK. That's it. Thanks for watching my tutorial video. And if you like my videos, please subscribe so you will not miss my new videos. See you soon.